We met through mutual friends at a soccer game. This was during high school, 2007? Seven. 2007. Yeah. yeah. That's when John first spotted me in the crowd. Yeah, she was on the bus wearing this bright red shirt. She stood out. <laughs> she stood out. And then, yeah, she stood out in many ways. Yeah. And then after the um, game, you asked Philip Chim for my Emerson. Yeah, this was back in the Emerson days. <laughs> Added her on Emerson. And that's how we started our friendship. friendship. memorable experience was our first overseas trip together to Japan. We made the trip to Mount Fuji and the whole day Mount Fuji was covered in clouds so we couldn't catch it but luckily when we made our way to the pagoda it just cleared up and it just didn't look like it was beautiful. It didn't look real. It looked like a painting. It was yeah. amazing. Yeah. And John and I just sat there staring at the view for ages and it was just the most beautiful thing ever and that's when John proposed actually so yeah. it tops all of our other memories. Uh, I guess a message I would uh, tell you mm. is that uh, I don't know I don't want it to be too cliche but it, it really is true I will always love you and always be there for you through the hard times through the fun times and, yeah. <laughs> you know, I always told you, since the day I met you, you're my best friend. And I know that no matter what you go through, you yeah, will always get through it. And in the future, I know things will get tough. We'll have good times and bad times, and you know, we'll always get through it. Um, you always make me laugh, which is so important to me. You're always so supportive in everything I do, even when I decided to live overseas with it. You're supportive and I never felt like I was ever alone because you're always there. So thank you and I know you're going to be a great husband, you're going to be a great father. You're great. I'm glad I'll be sharing this next journey with you.